all the way up there. It's Connie from Faf Designs. Welcome to the Dixie Belle YouTube channel. I am one of your Dixie Belle brand ambassadors and today I am revealing a brand new transfer for you. It is called Balance Transfer and I'm hiding it boop, boop, behind on this little tabletop. So I did a watery theme and I'm going to show you how I did it. As you can see, this table was a painted finish and that's a factory finish, how it came out of the shop. It's quite a newish, modern piece. It's not got any age. And for that reason, I'm gonna prime it with Dixie Bell's Slick Stick so that my paint adheres to the surface. First of all though, I am gonna give the piece a good clean with Dixie Bell's White Lightning and I made a little repair to the leg. Once it was clean and dry, I did scuff sand the piece because there was some imperfections on the surface. And then I went in with Slick Stick Primer. I did two coats of this and then let it dry overnight before I started painting. The first colour that I used was Vintage Duck Egg and this is from the Chalk Mineral Paint line. I'm applying it with a Bestang brush and I'm also mixed in a small amount of sea spray just to, so that the paint had a little bit of texture because the table did have some imperfections on it. Next, I used cobalt blue with a synthetic brush and just stippled it into the wet vintage duck egg, creating a kind of mottled effect. I then added some Bunker Hill Blue a little bit further down the legs. I'm going to give this table an ombre look in using only blue tones. So I'm just stippling that in with the Vintage Duck Egg and Cobalt that I've got kind of partially down the leg. And this is just going to give a kind of mottled blend. It's not going to be a perfect blend, but it's going to be kind of mottled. And I'm kind of looking to replicate the look of water. The deepest blue is in the navy and I'm going to start at the very bottom of the leg and work my way up to Bunker Hill Blue and then where the two meet I am going to use the same technique again and kind of just stipple the colours together. For the second coat I just repeated pretty much exactly the same as the first step and this is just going to give you full coverage of all those blues. And now for the transfer. So again, I'm using a transfer called Balance. It's a brand new transfer from Dixie Belle Paint. It's a four sheet transfer and it's made up of fish, water lilies and lily pads. It's a really versatile transfer and you can design lots and lots of different unique designs from it. So I'm starting in the center of my table and then I'm gonna kind of make the design flow to the kind of corners. Um, the centerpiece is kind of all one design that's intertwined and then you also get lots of separate elements like the fish and then I'm going to build my design, like I say, in a sort of flowing organic design to replicate fish in a pond. Once I was happy with the design, I then sealed the top of the table all over with Dixie Bell's clear coat in satin. Once the clear coat was dry, I just wanted to add a little bit more dimension on the tabletop. So I went in with Vintage Duck Egg and just added some dry brush detail to the top. If you do want to add any paint to your transfer like I'm doing, even though it is just a very small amount of paint and I'm just dry brushing the edges, you must make sure you seal your transfer first before applying paint. And that's because any moisture that gets underneath the transfer can cause it to lift. Then I used cobalt blue with an artist brush just to give the fish um, a kind of a shadow in areas. I used it with quite a lot of water to give a watercolour effect. I didn't want too solid colour here. And then I kind of blended it out into the vintage duck egg colour. Mm -hmm. 
Again, because I'd added the paint over the top of the transfer, I wanted to just seal that again. So I added another two coats of clear coat in satin with a synthetic brush. And here's the finished thing. I really hope you like it. Make sure you are subscribed to the Dixie Bell channel for more painting makeovers.